everyone i know it's been absolutely ages since i last vlogged but there is a reason why and you might be able to just see him in frame here and that's because we recently got a puppy and here he is hang on Ooh. do you want to say hello he's a bit sleepy because he was just sleeping so he's a little bit tired a little bit tired so i don't know if you know much about puppies but he's a whippet pup i don't know if you can tell it's very squirmy i'm sorry i woke you up oh big yawn um and he is 13 weeks old 14 on wednesday actually um he loves to chew things don't you okay so i've just put him back down to sleep because he was getting really wriggly um so yeah just a bit of facts about milo which is his name so he's a whippet, he's a fawn whippet, and we got him really quickly actually. We were expecting a lot of research to be done and it would take us a couple of weeks or months even to find the right breeder and the right puppy, but the first breeder that we went to were amazing and they only had two puppies left at that stage because they were going to keep one out of two and they decided to keep the girl dog and we wanted a boy dog anyway, so... Um, we kind of ended up with Milo, which is great. So everything just sort of clicked into place quite quickly. And at that point he had already been seven weeks and the recommended time to take a puppy home is at eight weeks. So within like a week we were like, okay, so we're getting a puppy in a week's time. So we had a lot of stuff to sort out like vaccinations, booking vet appointments, like getting all his stuff, like bed and food and things like that. I just had to adjust the camera there because the sun decided to come out and um, we've just had the massive beast from the east sort of snowstorm recently so it's all melted today but um, it was nice to have the snow for the first time with the pups so that was really cool he got to experience snow not a fan um, whippets are really thin and they also don't have that much fur so they pretty much go outside naked essentially so they need coats and things like that and because it was been because it's been about minus two or something or even colder than that at night he's been struggling to go out but potty training's going well he kind of knows that he needs to do his business outside but he doesn't really know how to tell us that he needs to go outside so at the moment he just kind of whines um and he does run to the back door um so he's kind of getting it but he loves to chew so pretty much anything he can get his teeth into he will chew no matter what kind of material, yeah, he will chew absolutely anything. This is his favourite toy, which is like a squeaky raccoon. Um, I don't know why he loves it so much. It was the first toy we gave him, so maybe he's like, just got attached to it. And we are crate training him, so at night he sleeps in a crate. So we've got one crate where he sleeps and is like his den, and attached to that is another crate for if he needs a wee or something in the night. But for the past four nights, he's managed to not wee or anything for I think is about six hours in the crate at night so that's gone really well and we didn't really need to train him to like the crate at all he as soon as we took him home he went straight in the crate sat down in it and was happy as Larry also have a couple of trips coming up um, without puppy that were booked before we got him 
and one is Slovenia in, well it's not for a while actually, it's not until later this year and there might be a summer one coming up soon as well and yeah hopefully get more back into the swing of things with vlogging and I just really enjoy it so and I want to have these memories as well because puppies grow up so quickly that I just want to video so much and I don't know just capture all the moments already has grown so quickly from when we first got him which was mid-January and now it's the beginning of March and you can already can see the differences. What I'm going to do because I've recorded a lot since we got him I'm going to insert some footage just so you can properly meet Milo and see his little personality. It's going to be a big part of our lives obviously so he's going to feature on this channel I think quite a lot. This little pause here. So yeah that is my very exciting news. I hope you enjoyed this video and the little update and I will see you very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye!